Hello everyone, my name is Connor, or Pins on Needles as I'm known on Switch, and I'm going to get right down to it. I participated in the Day 1 Val of the Disciple raid. It was a very, very good raid, had a very good time. Uh, my crew and I finished contest mode uh, on Sunday night at right at midnight. So uh, we spent like, tw I spent personally like 25 hours in the raid, it was a good time. Needless to say, these symbols on the screen right now are etched into my brain like nothing else. Uh, however, I am now getting to the point where I'm teaching people how to do the raid, and it's kind of daunting to throw all of these symbols at them and just be like, you, you gotta know them on the fly. Uh, you, got, you gotta be able to call them back out, right? So, I had this idea last night in my sleep, and I am a uh, software programmer by day, and I, you know, I stream at night. And I had this idea, and I just couldn't get it out of my head. So today, when I got off work, I sat down and I kind of hacked it together. The the code is is what I would call a hackathon <laughs> code. Uh, so it's not very clean. If there are any programmers in the audience, uh, you know, you're you're gonna be somewhat upset with me um, over over how messy this is. However, uh, what it does is it makes this little window right here. Now, what does the window do? Well. It displays the callouts as you say them out loud. So you see, you may have noticed that this uh, little window down here in the bottom right is transcribing everything that I say. And it's uh, if, if I were to say one of these words, which I somehow haven't at this point. So let's say that I say the word pyramid. I give it a second and it comes up. So it, it, it collects a, a bunch of speech at once and then it kind of parses through the whole thing. That way, if you say multiple, then it will all comp at once. So, um, but for right now, I'll show you uh, that it kind of climbs up. So you get a history of the past three that you said. So now let's say kill. And at some point in there, I said the uh, F-A-C-E, which it may uh, catch that too. I'm not sure. Um, but, you know, you could say uh, three at once and you would get a full pop-up. So I, I assume that most people read top to bottom. So let's say that you say scorn, guardian, stop. Then you're going to get all those at once in the order that you said them. Uh, if from there you were to say drink. It would show up at the bottom and the history would continue to push up. Uh, there are some notes. Um, the voice recognition library that I'm using in Python doesn't know words that aren't words. Uh, so Savathun is, uh, has been changed to Witch Queen. And that's the only concession I had to make, I believe. Uh, so on top of the official Bungie callouts, uh, it also has support for your own custom callouts. So what you do is you go over to this uh, config file and there's a second array of, of strings here and it's it's a copy of this but I've changed some of the words to what my team used on day one and admittedly likely what I'll be telling the uh, people that I run it through with. So for example, um, so all I have to do uh, I have to I have it on default right now. That means default mode right there. If I click that, it changes to custom mode. And you can clear it if you want. And let's say, now I'm going to say chalice, vault of glass, green. And you get exactly what I was expecting to see. The, the actual words <laughs> for that were drink, enter, black garden. But we called them uh, chalice, vog, uh, but I changed the vault of glass because, of course, Vogue isn't a word. Actually, it recognizes Vogue, but whatever. So there's a lot of flexibility here. You can change it around. Uh, my my kind of vision for it would be that like a Sherpa would tell like a new player like, "Hey, uh, it's it's you know Tower Score and Ghost," and then. Um, or ghost isn't the right call out. <laughs> it, but, uh, you know, a person, a uh, Sherpa would say, uh, love, kill, scorn. And then uh, the a, a new player would repeat that back to them. And while they're repeating it, it would also show it directly on their screen. 
So uh, this is probably falls under useless inventions because I don't know who's going to run this on a second monitor when they're running a raid or if any new players would actually use it. Uh, but in my head, it seemed fun and interesting and I never it a lot of lot of stuff I hadn't done before. Um, so, uh, yeah, I wanted to get it out there and share it. Uh, I'll put the code in GitHub if anybody wants to pull it down and compile it. Um, yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this, you can find me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash pins on needles. I play a lot of destiny and, uh, some other variety of games too. Uh, so check me out. I'll talk to you later. Bye.